Okay, welcome. This is another picture, and there are some words you have seen that. Where the process of othering, creating binary opposition to Western ideas, and what? No. Medicine approach. We have already discussed that previous one as well. The process of othering, creating binary opposite. Binary opposite. Binary means what? Double strand, double means. I mean, support. What should be? Day, night, good, bad. These are binary opposites. Binary means double to opposite to you. Can, you can understand that. This is the completely opposite day. Male, female, etc. Okay. Similarly, here we have seen that us and other. Us and other. Okay. You can open it and you don't. I never want it. Okay. Then, of what? You have seen that. The scenario of it. What does it mean that you, you have seen just of what? He's unchanged. He's unchanged. Why? Because he's a colony. He's colonized. Hmm? So, what's happened here? You have seen that savage, uncivilized, good lads, stupid, cultural lacking, and sexually yes. is. Sexually is. What does it mean that? Our women are easy in the access to entertain them. Sexually easy. That is their notions. They're telling that. So, which I have already mentioned, okay? Then, there's one uh, to do what he said. When the missionaries came to Africa, they had the Bible and we had the land. They had nothing, only the Bible and we had the uh, land. They said, let us pray. We closed our eyes. We closed our eyes. When we opened them, we had the Bible and they had the land. Have you got the masses of Desmond Tutu? Tutu? What he says? Even we have seen that in our uh, country. The, what is the function of the Christian missionaries? Why they have come here? They have come here for what reason? To destroy us. They say that we will give you a free teacher at your home to educate your children English. They started with the Bible. Example I can give you. Please try to read Begum Rukia's Nars Nelly. It's a very shortest story. Five Pages short story. Okay? There you have seen, you will see that. The Christian missionary teacher comes to a house and gradually she starts of what? Teaching only the Bible, not other things. And at the end, we have seen that the lady lives his own religion and accepts the Christianity. That is their notion. I mean, so what? When we open our eyes, we have seen that we have the Bible and they have the land. Can you understand the meaning of it? In your society, there is a uh, here saying like that where to some people of what? Some people sell the wine and they buy of what? It is like that. Okay? They sell all of the wine and take some what? Milk and we are giving them milk and importing. Drink or wine. Next one, you have this picture. Sexual is easy, okay? They are doing it what? Mimicry. Mimicry. Uh, can you uh, know the meaning of mimicry? What does it mean? The following without any kind of support. Justification. Photocopy. We can say that. Then of what? Gender issues. Cultural hybridity. Then of what? Generation gap and cultural heresy. So you have seen that. We have the cultural, uh, we have the generation gap with our. Okay, ancestors. As a result, we have seen that we cannot accept them. It's our problem. Who has created the problem? Western. The Western people. Then what? Economic dependence and control. Cultural. Homo. Generation. MB. Wells. That is called the word. Diaspora. That is another thing. Diaspora means support. Dual meaning. Dual standard. You are not feeling interest. To write something else in your own language, you intend to, what? to write something else to their, with their language. What does it mean that? It's a diaspora. Double standard. Amends, double standard. Dual character. Okay? Then uh, another impact we have seen that just 
loka. There's a great question of the what? Identity. Why not? National culture. We have forgotten what is our national culture. For example, day by day, gorgeously we are trying to celebrate 31st night. That destroys a part of our own national own culture, own identity, national identity. Religion, regional culture, regional culture, local culture. We don't know. Every community have their own culture. In our country, there are a number of communities. Whenever we go to other countries, we see that. We are the common folk. But in our country, we are the separated. We have forgotten it also. Sexual culture. We have already seen that. The relationship, men and women. The relationship between men and women and the relationship between men and women of the Western country are not the same. Then of what? Racial culture. Black and white, East and West, upper and lower class, middle class, etc. Then of what? Religious culture. What is the better? Nowadays, especially uh, after um, whenever Donald Trump comes to the uh, power, what we have seen that? That we are feeling religious culture. Then professional culture, obviously. What? They have taught us that. It is the oversight, it is the goat task. But in England, in, in other Western countries, what happens in that? There is no discrimination professionally. Who is the Prime Minister? Who is the Labour? It doesn't matter. Everyone privileges the similar rights. So, that is the problem in our country. And other what the gender culture, ethnic culture and socio-economic class culture, it is also the factor to understand the colonial what text, okay? Then uh, globalization of culture, we are uh, frequently uh, mentioned these things, that as we have already mentioned. So in brief, we can again repeat something else. Considering post is a it prefix meaning after. Meaning, after general meaning, it's actually, we need to first discuss the history behind colonialism. History behind colonialism. What is colonialism? An <coughs> extension of a nation's rule over territory beyond its borders. For example, Bangladesh is an independent country. When it intends to conquer the other country beyond its what, boundary, that is called the what? Colonialism. Okay? If you conquer your, uh, some people in your own country, that should not be called a what? Colonialism. That is a marginalized or subaltern. So the term is a different. Inside your country, whenever you do the something else, it means that you are making someone what? Sub subaltern, marginalized. But whenever you would control the other countries, conquer the other countries, rule the other countries illegally, that is called colonialism. Then a population that is subjected to the political domination and the population. I mean support. That conquered country would be a part. Rules. Suppression by the others. Okay? Then uh, two sides of the colonialism. One is a what? Multi. Yeah, sorry, uh, the military side, the physical conquest and the occupation of territories. And second one is what? Civilizational side, the conquest and occupation of mind. before the end of the colonial occupation okay next one the historical 
where why the West attempts systematically to cancel or negate the cultural difference and the value of the non-West. Lila Gandhi, she uh, mentioned it. You have seen that, it, what does it mean that whenever they say what differentiates between non-Western and Western cultures and they attempts to humiliate your own culture or native culture in that time colonialism started okay then the other thing is uh, it is then what is post-colonial uh, criticism a set of as whenever you read uh, whenever you uh, uh, will read the text as a post-colonial critic post-colonial through the post-colonial lens you must apply it okay a set of theoretical and critical strategies used to examine the cultural, culture, literature, politics, history of former colonies. Post-colonial theory deals with the reading and writing of literature written in previously or currently colonized countries or, the, or literature written in colonizing countries which deals with colonizing or colonized peoples and it embraces no single method or school I mean support it has no specific method or school school means our branches of the knowledge how you can it means of what from your own country you should have set up the lens to what to capture the to catch that to identify the intention of the western countries or colonized countries or colonial countries got my point so it also bends why not because the culture and the values, the tendency of the Eastern may not match with the Western people or the African people. So you must, you must what? Change it and it will be very place to place. Then post-colonialism, question the effect of empire, then what? Rises issues and such as racism and exploitation Next one, access the position of the colonial or post-colonial subject offers a counter narrative to the long tradition of European imperial narratives. Why are people colonized? The answer, first of all, social hmm? Darwinism. Darwinism. Darwinism, you know that meaning. Social Darwinism. What is that? First of all, Eurocentricism. Eurocentricism. What does it mean? Europe is the center. In the last class, we have said Europe is the center. And we are the marginalized. We are the around them. We are followers them. That's why they have the value. We have the value. It is one of the concepts they give in them. Universalism, which I have already mentioned. Okay? Universalism, the name of the universalism. Universality. They are trying to make, establish the colony. Colony. Colonialism in nature. I mean, it's a power relation. Power relation. Who has the power? They always try to avoid suppress the other. This is our tendency. White man's burden. What is that? What was thought to be an obligation to civilize non European people. They think that it is our burden, it is our social responsibility to make the people or what? Okay, civilized. To whom? Who are the non-European, non-Western? How long did it last and why did it end? 15th century to 20th century, arguably it is still going on. We have already mentioned the second half of the 20th century. Post-colonialism started. It means of what? It indicates that colonialism started. But some critics say that no, arguably it is still going on. But the shape, the tendency, it is a different, not the similar. Then of what? After the second world war, right to okay, sovereignty, then okay, lack of resources and independence movement. This helps to what? Get your or awake yourself. I mean, so this is the period of your post-colonialism. Then what? So post-colonial uh, theory attempts to focus on the oppression of those who were ruled under colonization. So the theory applies and only what practice in which a Western what 
western attempt to control the other people the nature to identify the nature first one second one is what in which way the colonized or the suppressed people replied as a result we have seen that Salman Rushdie and uh, Bill of uh, Astro Bill Bill and Astro they mentioned they have written two books one names is like that Imperial right to the back Imperial what does it mean that the tools the weapon they have used to suppress us at first we should try to know the nature of their weapon then of what we should what target on them and apply their own weapon to destroy them otherwise we cannot what control them got my point so to control western attitude movement we need it second one is what factors included political oppression economic social and cultural oppressions and psychological oppression nowadays they are trying to control which one economic and psychological and cultural oppression to control economics they apply these two as you have mentioned that without wearing the suit and boat you will not be the what gentleman okay this is our tendency and they change our culture as a result you will not enjoy your what own culture rather you are enjoying christmas day or the 31st night or something else yeah that is the reason then descriptions of what particular areas of emphasis include the india indian subcontinent northern and central africa and southeast asia this regions were under the control of colonial powers like england the united states and france they try especially the england the united states and france they are the big colonial power still now they are working all over the world also deals with the literature written by citizens of colonial countries that portrays colonized people as a subject matter so that is another interesting thing which way they used they use enough a huge money for what reason to portray the colonial people's attitudes is it clear so what does it mean that it means of what we cannot use ourselves we cannot use ourselves we cannot have see our own boys in our in their writing they obviously try to highlight themselves more interestingly have you ever any uh, autobiography of attojibini of anyone i raise a question all the autobiographies no writer has shown his or her any evil activities or false activities in their biography they always try to highlight support their own good activities this is very interesting and funny thing similarly the western country also does does this thing they try to highlight my evil act evil deeds and highlights their good activities this is a discrimination <coughs> criticism means of what criticism means of what an observation means of what what is good what is bad you must observe and you must put it there but without doing it intentionally they discriminate subjective and we become the subjective subject of their writing doll of their writing football of their writing okay and they are enjoying themselves next part deals with the conflict between ruler and subject mainstream and marginalized oppressors and oppressed and the same time celebrates the suppressed other other challenging the dominant culture and questioning concept of established authority second one the literature has that has been produced in former colonies reflects changes in the social political economical and cultural politics in what freed region and rebellion against anything that reminds of the colonizer edward said humike baba gayatri chakraborty spivak and important exponent of post colonial criticism we have already mentioned they contributed a lot to change our minds so 